everyone, Senrai Kai here. Today I'm going to be watching the ninth episode of the fourth season of Hinamori Sketch. Last time was pretty exciting because we actually had the, the festival. We got to do like a haunted house thing, which is pretty good. Some people thoroughly scared, I would say. That the mayor may not include me. We also got some dancing, so a lot of fun all around. But we're here for episode nine, so let's see exactly what we end up getting. And three, two, one, play. Whew. Ashy snow? Okay. All snow. Maybe the lighting just need to look ashy. <laughs> that is nice. That is not snow, whether I'll attire. Where did that come from? <laughs> See, you look black right there. Ow. Ow. <laughs> Not gonna keep Yuno down, that's for sure. Yeah, it does look black. <laughs> no, she ate them all. I sure hope you brought me breakfast. Uh, together. <laughs> can't, can't ignore that. <laughs> yeah, she brought reinforcements. A board game or life, I think. Yeah, game of life experience. <laughs> yeah, an adult like me will never play this, so here as a child, take this. <laughs> Yatta. Would you like to play too? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I feel like I get mixed messages from her sometimes. <laughs> bam, bam, bam. I swear life is like the only board game they play in anime. <laughs> Nazuna thinks she's so cute. And she's right. I don't know why his head looks the most ridic ridiculous when he's in the overall group shot. I guess it's just a sense of comparison with the everyone else's head and proportions and stuff, but anyway, give him back smile. Aha, the rest of the gang. I have nothing better to do. Okay. There's the wheel. It's so life confirmed. <laughs> I was thinking the same thing. I thought third years in high school in Japan can literally do nothing but study all day, every day. That's the impression I got from anime. <laughs> Ha ha ha. 
<laughs> no one does. Don't worry about it. He <laughs> don't Sure, why not? <laughs> I was about to say the same thing. Why is size room? Is the closest? <laughs> thick paper. Gotta be thick. <laughs> well, that's a nice picture. You know, like a car model. Man, that was so long ago. Like. A game of how nostalgic I feel for that. Yeah, that was fun. Which is, which which fits the Hidamari apartments, <laughs> right? <laughs> right. Oh wow. <laughs> Special, huh? Oh, okay. Okay, okay. Oh, wow. Wow, yep. <laughs> I almost choked on something there. I wasn't even eating anything. <laughs> can't, you can't just hit me with that all of a sudden. Uh, veterinarian. <laughs> she really made the thing. What was, what was, you should do an Asaya there. Oh, oh. It's very, very specific. <laughs> that would be great. <laughs> don't don't crush her spirits. She's doing great. I want you know to have the the Nya one. <laughs> We're never gonna get actually get to this game, are we? Yeah, she's just taking a nap. Did she really go to Sai's room for that? <laughs> I'm sure that's delicious. <laughs> I mean, I, I thought it was legit. <laughs> but <laughs> that is a that is a decent amount. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I, th I think we've all been there. <laughs> I think we're not on the same page. 
At least I've never seen Tofu run like that. <laughs> Sounds about right. <laughs> yeah, I don't think that's going to get you there. Let's just roll, let's just roll with it, guys. Four, five, seven, way too many, I think. <laughs> okay. I know I understand some of her choices. <laughs> Although really good blush out of out of note out of Nazina for it. <laughs> hey up girls. <laughs> It's kind of how the game works, okay? There's nothing personal, just business. <laughs> I, I don't know. <laughs> Actually, now I think about it, I think I do, that does sound familiar. Now that we're talking about it. <laughs> Good times. <laughs> yeah, oh, I... This is just a nostalgia feeling episode, isn't it? <laughs> Five? Well, that's what I think it's a thousand. Yeah, a thousand, yeah. <laughs> Sui! Oh, ten. She's going places. Bathhouse. Is everything a thousand yen? Or a thousand dollars, whatever. Whatever they whatever it is. A thousand. <laughs> hey. Hundred thousand, dang. <laughs> Aren't you glad to be a hype? <laughs> Hyper lucky girl. She got it. She got the thing. <laughs> I was about to say that is kind of a loophole there. But it does kind of ruin the fun. <laughs> nya. Chica nya. It's been way too long since Chica's actually been in the show. <laughs> so she's not psychic. Bag of music's actually kind of drowning out her voice a little bit. <laughs> yeah. Talk to her with the nyas, that would be so good. She'd be so confused. Please do it. <laughs> oh, they're all just waiting for this. <laughs> Especially Nazana. She did it. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Man, Chica rubbing it in. <laughs> that was an amazing reaction. <laughs> oh, my eyes are watering. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she couldn't have picked a better time to call. <laughs> All of our lives were built up to this moment. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha. 
That was that was great. All, all of that was great. My life is complete now. <laughs> of course you did. Yeah, more nostalgia. <laughs> okay, lap pillow it is then. Just make yourself at home. <laughs> you had to try. Nazar does not seem to mind in the slightest a lap pillow. <laughs> not her fault. Oh, wow. <laughs> Which I guess requires her to look like a librarian. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> it's just, just rapid fire, I see. <laughs> I just got the job already being yelled at. Young people full of hopes and dreams of lobby crushed. <laughs> Being a landlady? <laughs> what do you do all day? Focus has really shifted over to her, hasn't it? <laughs> oh! <laughs> Don't squish now's enough. That did not tell us a lot. Oh, wow. Twins. Yeah, congratulations. <laughs> Twins will be a handful, but y you got this. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Haircut, $4,000. <laughs> yeah, it's one of the basic things to do. <laughs> you know the game of life is outdated because... Nowadays, people don't really exchange physical money. You just, you know, use Zelle or you use your credit card or, you know, all online. For like a lot of things. Decent chunk of change. That was a naughty. There's naughty. <laughs> it's kind of suspicious. Yeah, we want it to be a positive game. <laughs> Genius. All pretty successful. I know, right? Uh, 
<laughs> uh, you know, you are too... You're too good for this world. Ida Marisol. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> oh, yeah, we never got to see that. What is it? Sympathy buddy. Ouch. <laughs> Forever. Let's make this a once a week thing, we all play it. I'm still thinking about the Chica scene. <laughs> How do you imagine that mess sent by? Well, it's the same thing about you now, so... <laughs> Here's a shot. <laughs> That's what life's all about right there. <laughs> that episode's almost over, sadly. <laughs> well, we legit spent the entire episode playing that game. <sighs> Haiku. That's not amazing, no. <laughs> I mean, it sounds about right. Educational snowflake. Okay, that... That was the... Uh, yeah, the, the ninth episode. <laughs> of a Hidamari sketch. So this episode, I, I wanna double check, did we really just spend the whole episode playing that game? Cause I know we obviously had a little bit of a setup period, but when did we actually start the game itself? Let's see.
This is where when they finish it, they ate their food because they were hungry. <laughs> we have the team up right there. But if you start, if we count the game starting as actually turning the dial. I think we right about here. Like, well, around 10 minutes, 15 seconds. Yeah, so I say it took up the whole episode, but we had about, you know, almost 10 minutes of just getting it set up and figured out. So, so, so that was a thing, you know, <laughs> because we couldn't just play like a normal game of life. We are the Hidamari apartment girls. We got to play Hidamari version, which I think was much better than the regular version, personally. But it was a cool idea for an episode, especially because uh, more because lately in the show, it has been a little bit about looking towards the future, figuring out what they want to do and all that. So a game of life does kind of does kind of uh, go with that a little bit, especially when they do customize it to, to what's actually you know, on their mind, like artist stuff and whatnot. So that was a pretty cool idea for an episode to have kind of that future theme to it while still just being a chill, relaxing, having fun together as a group, including the landlady sort of episode. So I thought that was really cool. I had to see a lot of their creativity at work there. And uh, landlady's just weird though. Like, why does she want to sleep at Sai's place? Why was she so clingy with Nozin in this episode? <laughs> like, I know she's like the most pure moe of the girls and that might be what attracts her to her, and if that's the case, then fair enough, but I don't know, it just seemed like some clear favoritism for one of the girls, which I don't think she should be doing, but... Oh well, <clears throat> not really a big deal, nobody seemed too jealous, and Nazuna's reactions were certainly, were certainly fun. But, we know, but when the episode really, really hit its peak was during the Sai landing on the token that made her end her sentence with Nya, right? <laughs> Uh, and she was going to be like, no fun allowed with the whole, well, I just won't say anything at all, though, which is the obvious loophole to that sort of thing. But Chica, <laughs> Chica will not let that happen. I think that scene was around four, 13, 14 minutes around there. I believe. Let's see. Yeah, then she should speak with her big sister, too. Your big sister wants to talk to you as Saya just tries to stop this crazy woman. Is an Chunk going to talk to me? Because <laughs> Chica has no idea what's going on right here, you know. The fact that they specifically want to give her the phone so they can get the Nias out of sight. <laughs> she has no idea at this point that that's happening. Uh, but I loved it after she gets the phone and she looks over at the whole gang. Everyone, literally everyone, is doing like a cat paw thing. <laughs> because they, they, want it, they want Saya to nya at her little sister <laughs> over the phone. Like, that's all they ever wanted in life. Sorry, but I'm just going to rewatch re this entire scene and commentate it. Hope you don't mind that too much. But then we get another shot of the whole group, where Nalzna was my favorite, because she's like, eyes wide open, and nobody else is. I mean, they have, like, lines, but anyway. And that, that shot there, at 13 minutes, 20 seconds, Nalzna's the only one with her eyes, like, wide open, mouth open, hands over the mouth. One of the cutest poses she's done in the show so far, so... That it was worth bringing attention to. And then it starts. But Tashi and Nya. <laughs> of course, that's the first Nya. That wasn't enough for Chika to, to fully get it. She was just like, what did I hear? What, what, wait, what? <laughs> you know, that kind of reaction to it. <laughs> but then she does it a second time. <laughs> yeah, I can only imagine just the sheer power of the blush that's on Saya during this scene. Because that's half the fun right there. Not just the Nya's, which are already good, but... The embarrassment you get from Saya during the scene is what really that makes it makes the whole thing peak. In the middle of the game, so I'm hanging up. Yeah, yeah. So it was a couple more nyas, and I think that's when she got it. <laughs> and we even had like the little like emoticon on the phone screen. But the laugh that Chica did was just pure gold. Like, <laughs> and you can't blame her because that's obviously. Um, very out of character for Saya, so to have her do it so unexpectedly, you can only, can only imagine just a look on Chica's face. <laughs> just a laughing is so good. And even as she gets angry, she has to still meow at the end of all of her angry statements, which just makes it even funnier for, for, <clears throat> for Chica. And the screen literally shaking. <laughs> but she's right, Yone Chan, you don't sound threatening at all when you do the Nihaz. So that was great. 
I think we get one more shot of the group. Just, <laughs> yeah, just uncontrollable laughing over there, <laughs> which was so good. But yeah, everyone thoroughly enjoyed that. So that was definitely the peak of the episode. So I just wanted to go through that slowly in detail. But I don't think I have too much more to say about the episode beyond that. Everyone having fun, making money, losing money, mostly making money because it's a positive game. <laughs> Gotta love uh, Hero kind of helping uh, Sire with our finances a little bit over there. <laughs> uh, but I just didn't feel enough like a couple as it was. <laughs> but. And that pretty much was the episode. You know, we had a really nice scene between Nori and Nazuna on the bed, which I thoroughly enjoyed that. <laughs> but yeah, I feel like they get a lot of those scenes that just make them seem really close to each other, right? And definitely that bed scene may have been one of the best ones we've gotten so far. <laughs> but but as always, we end off with the Yuna bath scene. It's kind of the signature of this show, I think. <laughs> so we can't just not have it. But yeah, really good stuff, you know? Nothing too much really happened in the episode. I think it was almost entirely contained in that one room. <laughs> I think, yeah, I mean, there might, may have been a little bit of outside stuff. Like, like barely outside, if you can even call it that. <laughs> like outside the door. <laughs> but like, the whole episode was in there. And they, and kind of like not giving some nods towards some other stuff that's happened in the show. The nostalgia bits. That was cool too. <laughs> Definitely added a nice little touch to it. You know, as we move towards the future, we remember the past and all that. But... But yeah, good stuff. I enjoyed the episode. So thank you for watching and hope to see you in the next video. Until then, bye bye.